How's it going, everybody? This is Mike, Mr. Tiny Timmons, and I'm back again with a new episode of Single Section Sunday, where on Sundays I showcase a particular single section home that we have available right here at Recreational Resort Cottages. And this Sunday, I'm bringing to you the Medora. I am back again with a all new episode of Single Section Sunday. And yes, your eyes are not fooling you. If you're a long time subscriber, then you have seen this model or this styling before. But of course, we have to add our tweaks. This has been highly requested over the past year and a half. Please bring back the monoslope style single section homes. Well, if you ask hard enough, we will come back with it. So with that said, with this demand, I'm showcasing to you today the home by the name of Medora. With that said, this is a three bedroom, two bath, 1100 square foot, 16 wide by 76 feet long, single section coming in at a great price of 124,000. What makes this home separate itself from the rest is, as you see, the big curb appeal with that monoslope style roof and all of the windows that you're going to get on the front this adds the modern flair that you've been asking for starting here with the exterior of the home you'll notice that it has a board and bat it's exterior siding in garlic clove also you'll see that we have a lapped siding accent up top in black magic also you'll see that we have an array of windows going down the front side of this home. Everything from traditional windows to transoms and even coming along here on the covered front porch. This is a covered entry for you and this is a great area that you can have for exterior living while keeping this aesthetic and modern style that you have come to know and love. And as we speak about this covered entry, follow me up and you'll see that we have the rebar railing. We have the wood tops and bottoms to the railing painted in garlic clove as well, as well as your large post. Notice as well that you have the three traditional windows here, three transoms up top, and even two can lights right here on your exterior. That is the modern aesthetic and that little added extra that you're looking for. Also, behind this Texas Star door, painted in white, follow me inside so I can showcase why this may be the home that you're looking for. As you come inside, you'll see here what makes this so great is the light and airiness of this floor plan and the way that we've designed it today. As soon as you enter, we'll come right over to the living area. We'll make our way over to this side of the home first. As you see, you have ample space for full-size furniture and decor. You'll see in here we put a L-shaped sectional just to give you a vision of what can be done. What I would say is that it may work better for a couch and love seat combo or a couch and recliner combo to give you functionality at its peak for this floor plan. Also notice that we have double transoms right here on this side of the living room wall, but also notice as it elevates on this monoslope style roof line, we make our way over to the large living room wall where you have three picture windows, three transoms up above, and ample nat natural light coming in to this home. Also notice that your vents are all in the ceiling. That is a ode to the quality of construction that we provide here at Recreational Resort Cottages. We have the black blade ceiling fan, and pardon me that I had to keep it up and running for this video tour, but it is summertime in Texas and it is hot. So outside of these housing prices being so hot, this home is hot as I'm shooting it. So I apologize. But with that said, look at the functionality of the living area. I love this. It's great for entertaining, great for a primary residence, but also just as lovely for a secondary getaway. Imagine 
this type of home sitting out on your lake property or your weekend getaway property that you have where you can sit and if you got any view this may be the one for you now follow me back through and we'll make our way down this hallway where of course what are you going to see more windows more natural light coming in as i told you in the beginning this is a three bedroom home coming in at 1100 square feet with that said you're going to have the first of the three bedrooms here you'll notice here that we have the window again here off the rear side again the low style roof on the back side it elevates as we get to the front you notice the black blade ceiling fan here and we even have the closet right here for your convenience so great for storage as well now follow me on out and we'll make our way down this is the space for your central heating and air system we got the hvac there we have an exterior door here so just in case you want it to have ease of access to the bathroom or you're utilizing this for a guest style getaway where you have one set of guests on one end of the home another set of guests on the opposite end of the home they can utilize their own door to access this area just an idea with that said as we make our way into the guest bathroom you'll see here that we have the countertop here with the calcutta countertop we have the black satin cabinets and black bar pools we have the functionality of the floor plan with it being a tub shower combo so we've got the tub base down below the shower style faucet up top and the transom window again of course bringing in the natural light with that said whether you have any guest of all ages the functionality of this bathtub i don't have to tell you goes a long way especially for small children now follow me back through and we'll make our way to the second guest bedroom this is on the end of the home as we come in here you'll see that we have a window here off the rear end wall we also have a window there up front and an additional transom just to keep that exterior aesthetic going so that way everything's elevated everything has the feng shui that you've seen on the outside of the transom going all along the front of this Medora. also we have the closet right here for your convenience notice down to the details ladies and gentlemen the black hardware the black lever door also we come into the closet this is going to be larger than the previous bedroom closet so you see i've got a little walkability in here also your hot water heater is has a false wall right here where it's located behind so that you have an interior access to that water heater shall you need to do so also this has plenty of space so you could either put your bed on this wall you could put your bed on this wall either one you have the functionality now follow me back through and we'll start getting to the fun part this was the guest side now let's get back through and see how much and how many extras this home has again we're making our way back into the living area i've shown you this living room side look at the small area here that you have just with the functionality of this floor plan and the way that it offsets with that covered entry again you can utilize this area for for things i know if you're out here, you may want to use it as a primary residence. You may need a designated workspace. If you don't want to utilize one of the bedrooms, here's an idea for you. Also, if you're at your weekend getaway, hey, sometimes I know how it is. You got to run, check the emails real quick. You got the space to do so right here. Just giving ideas for you. But I love with this covered entry that it has the recessed uh, version right here. So you'll see that we've included windows and get an interior shot of this all the way around. Also, with that said, I love separating the living room from the kitchen that you have the designated area for dining. Again, you can put a small table like we've done so here, or you can even put a larger drop leaf table or larger traditional table here and have the space to do so. Now, follow me back through. We'll make our way into the kitchen, but get a good shot of this front area here, that Texas Star door, those windows. I'm telling you guys, this is a great floor plan, a great layout, and I love the openness of this kitchen. You see that we've added the black satin cabinets in this model. We have the black bar pools, Calcutta countertops. We have the catch ice backsplash going from the countertop up to the bottom of the cabinet. We kept the stainless steel appliances in this model. So you know we had to add the one basin stainless steel farm sink with detachable sprayer. That's a fan favorite. So you know I have to throw it in there. 
window up above the sink so that way you can look out onto your property as you're cleaning up. Also, we have the abundance of cabinetry going around. We have the black stone crest Vena hood right here, adding that more modern aesthetic and flair. Again, the smooth top oven, you could convert to gas if you chose to do so, but we'll make our way on here and you'll see that the side-by-side -side refrigerator with ice in the door is tucked over to the side of the kitchen. I love that because you get ample access to these 42 inch style cabinets that are built in here, as well as your built in stainless steel microwave with additional storage up above. Why not get more storage than you possibly need? It's better to have too much than not enough. Now follow me on down and you'll see here that the side-by-side -side washer and dryer area is great. Most of the time in single sections, you're going to have the stacked washable washer and dryer. With this, you get the side-by-side -side and you get the additional cabinetry on each side with the wood rod to conjoin them. Also, we'll follow our way back as we come in here. Why not? Instead of having just some bare space here, why not give you an additional storage closet? So that is a great feature. And this is what you came for, the primary bedroom. And we'll make our way into the biggest of the three bedrooms. And you'll see as you come in here, again, you have the black blade ceiling fan. We have two, not one, but two st traditional style windows down below, two transom style windows up top. And then we have, again, not one, but two closet doors right here with the open swing. And of course, you get the biggest closet of them all in the house, of course. And then again, if you get a little walkability in the guest closet, what you think you're going to get here in the primary closet? Also, we got the shelf and rod up top. We'll close this back. And also what you get, I told you, this is a three bedroom, two bath. So you are able to get an ensuite primary bath. And as we make our way in, you'll see here that you get dual vanities right here in this home. You've got the black fixtures on each side with the black faucets there. Again, we kept the satin black cabinets. We have the drawer bank included as well as the three door pantry right in here. Even your mirror in your bathroom is trimmed and painted black. So that is color coordination. Also, we went ahead and added the step in shower right here in fiberglass a lot of times we'll tile the shower that is an option you can do but in this home hey we we prep this specifically for the client that is not needing a tile shower they wanted just something that was functional and convenient to get in get out wipe down as needed also we have the transoms up, up top to bring in that natural light we've even tucked away your toilet there around the corner with the linen up above the toilet as well. Now follow me on out and you'll see here in this primary bedroom, you have ample space to put up to a king size bed with ease. So follow me on back through and see that this open concept, open layout of the Medora may be the one that you're looking for. Get a great look of that wild dove flooring going from front to back. If you're paying attention, you notice that there's no cabinetry in or excuse me, no carpet, I should say. There's a bunch of cabinetry, but no carpet in this model anywhere. So that gives you plenty of in and out. All you gotta do is sweep it up, swiffer it, whatever. You do not have to bring a vacuum in here and it works great for pets as well. Again, I wanna end it here in the kitchen so you can get a good look at this black and white combo. Just letting that be known. Also, again, just for a small recap, this is the Medora three bedroom, two bath. It is 1100 square feet and it is coming in at 16 feet wide, 76 feet long and on sale today for 124K. 124,000, you're getting everything that you see in this video besides furniture and decor again. So I hope that you enjoyed this video tour that I've showcased today. If you have, please hit that thumbs up and that like button and let me know so this video can be spread to more and more people that are currently in the market. Also, if you have not already, hit that subscribe button. If you're subscribed like you should be, then you're part of the family. If not, please, we looking for more family members. Come on, there's enough for everybody. You can be a part of this family here at Recreational Resort Cottages. Also, leave a comment. Let me know what your favorite feature of the Medora was. 
Also, if you have been one of those long awaited subscribers asking since we featured this styling of single section, you know, a couple years ago and you are waiting on it to come back, leave a comment down low and let me know if you're happy that the monoslope style single sections are back and better than ever. Also, if you're interested in purchasing this Medora today or any other model, just hit me up directly on Instagram at the Mr. Tiny at T H E M R T I N Y. You can connect with I anytime. I'm selling the Medora as well as hundreds of other models directly off of my Instagram. So you can contact me day or night and I'll make sure that price is right. And until next time, my name is Mike, Mr. Tiny Timmons, and I'll see you next single section Sunday.